Okay, the next step we will be doing, in your kit you'll have a piece of quite rough sandpaper. Best thing to do is just fold it in half so it allows you to grip it better. All we're going to do is sand this surface so all of the three actually align with each other. It takes a few minutes, but if we give it a good rubbing like that, we'll see that it is actually sanding off the excess leather and also cleaning the edge up of any glue that might have got caught on that welt. So the better you do this job, the better the end result will be when we come to stitching the actual sheet. Now what might have happened, as you can see here, it hasn't quite lined up. So this part of the sheath didn't kind of quite line up there and that's one of the reasons why we need to be sanding it so we can actually make them all even. So what we're going to do is I'll just freeze, I'll pause the tape for a while and I'll come back when it's all finished and show you what sort of results we're after. Okay, so I spent a couple of minutes cleaning this edge up and just going along the, the corner of it just to clean that up a little bit. Make sure that the end of the sheath is all nice and cleaned and tidy. Go along the corner, rounding that off a little bit. You don't want to take too much off because the the holes will then be too close to the edge. So just, just enough basically to make it so that uh, the all three surfaces are aligned with each other. Uh, don't worry about any fluffy bits that you see. They, they'll actually come off um, in due course. Um, if you wanted to uh, and uh, you felt they were really unsightly, you can actually use a knife, uh, sorry, uh, the... Um, lighter here and just gently burn the any real fluffy bits off okay so that just singes them off and just slightly rub it down okay that is basically all we need to do the next step will be to actually stitch it cross stitch the the, the shape and then it'll be finished <laughs> 